Hey, what's going on guys? It's No Shoes and we're back with another one and today we're going to be reacting to What You Don't Say from K Reno. This is suggested by Rob Gee, so thank you Rob for the suggestion. Keep coming in the comments down below. Let me know what y'all want to see next time and make sure you hit like and subscribe if you're enjoying seeing the K on the channel every single Tuesday. By the way, I dropped a new Cypher, No Shoes Gang Cypher Volume 3 this past Friday. I love it. I hope y'all love it too. If you haven't heard it yet, check it out. I'll put a link up in the top of this video at some point. But without any further ado, let's see what K got to say. Let's see what don't, let's see what, what you don't say is all about. Let's get it. Man, you know what? I don't care how real you say you are, man. It's like, everybody be, everybody. Certain things you just don't say. You be wanting to say it, but you don't say it. Uh. Everybody do it. <laughs> that don't mean it ain't no love there. I just mean that. I really like this beginning here. Feels like we're getting kind of an extended ramp up. That synth, that like high piercing quality it has. But there's also a nice bit of space on it. Feels really great, almost like kind of like sinister, maybe a little bit evil even. I'm really intrigued to see where this goes. I feel like we're going to get a hard drop with some like real heavy bass, and, uh, like a real heavy kick at least at some point. Let's see where it goes. And nice sound to Kay's voice, a little bit of extra gruffness today. <laughs> I don't mean it ain't no love that, I just mean that. Sometimes you just don't say it. I'm gonna show you what I'm talking about. I'm gonna show you what I'm talking about. I'm gonna show you. I'm gonna show you. Watch it. I'm gonna show you what I'm talking about. <laughs> this is a crazy intro. Probably one of the longer intros I've seen him do. Watch it. Watch it. I'm in the supermarket, no money to dine out. A child throwing a tantrum and his mama screaming time out. Now he kicking, screaming, yelling, disrespecting, bumping fast. I'm thinking to myself, if that was my son, I'd stomp his ass. My homie stopped. <laughs> Looking at the other parents like, man, what you doing, bro? I love that. I love that. No, uh, no money to dine out. Put him in time out. That was my kid, I whoop his ass. The change in the voice and changing like the mix for that that line there gives us that extra dimension, makes it a little bit more like a conversation, emulates, you know, when people change the inflection of their voice to show, you know, a different phase of what they're saying or however you would describe that. I can't think of the exact words right now, but love the start here. Seems like we're getting a little bit of a storytelling track. About the things that you keep to yourself, maybe. Screaming, yelling, disrespecting, bumping fast. I'm thinking to myself, if that was my son, I'd stomp his ass. My homie stopped me as he rolled up in his new car. Asked how I was doing, I said, not as good as you are. Chopped it up a minute <laughs> as I peeped some other things he showed me. Right. I'm thinking, when is this fool gonna give me that $25 he owed me? I saw my... Bro, that's facts, man. People rolling around, they getting new fancy things. They still owe you that money. Where's it at, huh? You gotta keep you gotta keep your debts in check, man. It's just honor at that point, right? Thinking, when is this fool gonna give me that twenty five dollars he owed me? I saw my home girl on Cullen showing all her parts. This girl weighed two eighty. Why the hell is she wearing them tight ass shorts? I gave me her number, told me let's go hang out one of these days. I said okay. And when she leave, I'm throwing this number away. This homeless. <laughs> Yo, this. <laughs> This is sick, bro. This is sick. That makes me that makes me think of the other night. Me and my boys were out at this Spanish club. I'm dancing this like older lady. You know, no hate to her. She was very kind. Comes up to me. I was like, I swear on my life, this lady better not ask me to dance. I don't know what to say, man. I'm not trying. <laughs> She's not the one, all right? Go hang out one of these days. I said, okay. And when she leave, I'm throwing this number away. This homeless dude said he was hungry. I said, all right, here. Hold up, I know this dude didn't use my money to buy no bill. None of this is personal, so don't take it the wrong way. These are just some thoughts that we think every day, but don't say. These are just... 
just some thoughts that we think every day, but don't say these are just some thoughts that we think every day, but don't say none of this is personal, so don't take it the wrong way. These are just some thoughts that we think every day, but don't say these are just some thoughts that we think. Okay, so a little bit more repetition on the hook than we typically get from K. At least so far, it seems like three of the same lines, two identical, one new line. Then we finish off with an identical again before starting that little four bars again. We'll go through the rest of the hook in a second here to see where it goes. But this is an interesting twist on intrusive thoughts, right? Because a lot of the times we think about intrusive thoughts as like, oh, I wonder what would happen if I just like turn around and punch that kid in class real quick. Or like you're looking over the edge of like a, a mountain or something while you're on a hike and you're like, I wonder how it would feel to fall from here. Or all those different weird things. But these are a little bit smaller. The more ordinary parts of life where it's like, man, I really don't want to be talking to this person. But I'm just going to smile and nod my head. Or, you know, all these different things that he's talking about here. What he would do if it was his kid going crazy in the, in the supermarket. How he feels about the girl who's trying to get at him and spit her game and everything. You know, this is a great idea. Especially... The, uh, the delivery is a, a little bit slower. I feel like a lot of the uh, K tracks we've been listening to have a little bit more of a spaced out delivery than um, some of the stuff we've heard in the past, but I'm sure it's a, a good mix. I mean, we're going back to the Maven here, so it's not like we're, we're current right now. But don't say none of this is personal, so don't take it the wrong way. These are just some thoughts that we think every day, but don't say these are just some thoughts that we think every day, but don't say these are just some thoughts that we think every day, but don't say none of this is personal, so don't take it the wrong way. These are just some thoughts that we think every day, but don't say. I'm at a okay. show, concentrating in my cooling state. Ran into this other female that I used to date. She bragging on herself. She done had too much to drink. She said, I'm the best woman you ever had. That's what you think. This dude was... <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Let her live in her, in her delusions, man. That's awesome. Yeah, nothing, you know, nothing crazy is happening. The wordplay is easily understandable. These situations are easily digestible. It's just a beautiful concept and a beautiful story being told here about all these tiny little fragmented moments where you decide to keep a little something to yourself because it's not going to help anybody for you to say it. I'm the best woman you ever had. That's what you think. This dude was on the mic. I'm wondering how long it lasts. Man, I hope I never hear you rap again. This song is trash. Police <laughs> harassing people ready to take some folks to jail. Checking boys for dope. Okay, y'all can leave. Thanks. Go to hell. I saw this queen as I was walking out. Man. <laughs> Facts, man. Facts. Honestly, there was one time. There's a spot down the street from me, right, where you used to be able to park, go out onto the trails, get down to the river, everything. All of a sudden, one day, they just start getting real pissy about people parking there, cops coming all the time, giving tickets, this, that, and the other. I saw this mom and her son just trying to get down, and this cop's, like, just basically forcing her to leave. I started oinking. <laughs> While I was walking across the street, the girl I was with at the time, she's standing there like, don't do that. Don't do that. He's going to get upset with us. Maybe that was something I shouldn't. Maybe the oinking should have stayed in my head. It seems like that's what Kay would do. But, you know, sometimes you got to let it out, man. Okay, y'all can leave. Thanks. Go to hell. I saw this queen as I was walking out. Man, she fine. Man, she fine. I said that out loud and in my mind. I saw this cat across the street. He talks a lot all in your ear. What's up, Curry? What's up, bro? Man, I hope he don't come over here. I'm coming over there. Damn. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know I'm wrong. 45 minutes later, they were still going strong. None of this is personal, so don't take it the wrong way. These are just some thoughts that we think every day, but don't say. These are just some... He's spitting some mad facts, too, man. He's spitting some mad facts. I, I can be on both sides of that last one at times. Some I, A lot of the times, I'm the dude that if you get me talking, I won't shut up. But... <laughs> <laughs> there are definitely a lot of times where I'll see like a bunch of people I know I'm like man just let me do my thing today I got places to be I'm tired like 
I don't want to talk. And it's just like, it's too late. It's too late. They saw you. You locked eyes. They coming over. You got to go through with it now. But we can all be these the versions of these people, man. It, it all happens in a, in a circle, right? Thoughts that we think every day, but don't you say you you. These are just some thoughts that we think every day, but don't you say you. None of this is personal, so don't take it the wrong you way you. These are just some thoughts that we think every day, but don't Stop. say These are just some thoughts that we think every day, but don't you say you. These are just some thoughts that we think every day, but don't you say you. None of this is personal, so don't take it the wrong you way you. These are just some thoughts that we think there's a little bit of layering on this hook that I didn't notice the first time around, but I'm enjoying it a lot coming back to it because it sounds like Kay is going, and you, and you, and you, or something like that, but the like somewhat deeper, maybe a little bit less layered, it kind of has like a more direct impact to it with that like little ad lib in the back, that backing vocal underneath the hook which definitely is a little bit more layered a little bit thicker and rounder in the feeling beautiful work here man very interesting track a very unique idea but something so relatable to everybody so don't take it the wrong way these are just some thoughts that we think every day but don't say took my son to the mall said pick whatever shoes you want headed towards them highest jordans you like these he said you don't yeah daddy these the ones <laughs> try them on see if you fit them yeah they fit how much are they oh my god okay let's get them i see my partner bragging like he had obama clout this fool is lying he just got kicked out his mama house wife been nagging all hold up did he say obama clout and rhyme that with getting kicked out of his mama's house <laughs> Bruh, that might be one of the craziest compound rhymes just because of the actual words used <laughs> that, <laughs> that is wacky hold up Daddy. oh my god okay let's get him i see my partner bragging like he had obama clout this fool is lying he just got kicked out his mama house wife been <laughs> nagging all day asking questions trying to crowd damn she getting on my nerves wait did I say that out loud? Brought me out to play the fool. What Yo, have y'all ever had that moment? This might be more unique than I realize, but I don't know. Where you feel like your thoughts become too loud and you start to worry. It's like, did I think that or did I say that? Because I definitely shouldn't have said that out loud. But it's too late. It's too late if I did. I can't go back on it. And, um... But yeah, again, the, the shoes being expensive, but... You know, showing a brave face for your kid. It's be beautiful storytelling here, man. Just all these tiny little moments that create a much larger character that's going through all of them. Be beautiful way to do it. Beautifully done. Would have trashed it if I could. She said, do you like it? No. Huh? Oh, yeah, it's good. Headed to my <laughs> nine to five. Money clean, no need to rob. Morning, sir. Ready to get to work. Damn, I hate this job. Dude selling burnt CDs. Coming at me like I want them. What you got? Promise if you pull mine out, I'm swinging on. See, none of this is personal. So <laughs> That's hilarious. Is he saying, like, if this dude's pirating my CDs and selling them? Imagine that. Like, you're the artist. And you walk up and some random dude on the sidewalk is selling pirated copies of your music. I don't know if I'd be upset or happy. Because, like, that's some real deal support if he thinks he can make money selling your music, right? I don't know, man. He might have to be one of the distributors. We might need to actually set up an agreement there. Promise if you pull mine out, I'm swinging on. See, none of this is personal, so don't take it the wrong way. These are just some thoughts that we think every day, but don't say. Beautiful. Beautiful. End with the line from the hook just once. Amazing, man. Obviously, that was what you don't say from K Reno. I would have never guessed that's what this track would be about based off the title. But then we get into it and it makes perfect sense. Having that second voice with the big reverb representing his thoughts works so well. Super clever idea here. Kind of reminds me of like Duality and a couple other tracks like The Therapist that uh, Kay has done. But beautiful track. Thank you again to Rob Gee for the suggestion. Keep coming in the comments down below. 
Don't forget to hit like, hit subscribe, and hit that bell, especially if you want to see more K every single Tuesday. Much love to everybody in the No Shoes gang, and I will see you all next time.